The artificial sweetener known as sucralose, or Splenda, is capable of altering the body's insulin response. This is according to investigators at Washington University School of Medicine, published in the journal Diabetes Care. The study included 17 severely obese individuals who didn't consume artificial sweeteners often and weren't diagnosed with diabetes. Each volunteer was given either water or sucralose to drink before a glucose challenge test, which involved the consumption of a similar glucose dosage to that of a glucose tolerance test. The researchers wanted to determine whether insulin or blood sugar levels are impacted by the combination of sucralose and glucose. Lead author Yanina Pepino claims that they especially wanted to study obese individuals as these sweeteners frequently are recommended to them as a means of making their diets healthier through caloric restrictions. The participants were each tested twice. They were first tested after drinking water followed by glucose and then after drinking sucralose followed by glucose. Pepino adds, when study participants drank sucralose, their blood sugar level peaked at a higher level than when they drank only water before consuming glucose. Insulin levels also rose about 20% higher. So the artificial sweetener was related to an enhanced blood insulin and glucose response. Sweeteners react with receptors on the tongue that make people believe they are eating something sweet, even if it contains no calories. The researchers claim that the gastrointestinal tract and the pancreas are capable of detecting sweet foods and drinks and respond by releasing hormones, such as insulin. The findings suggest that artificial sweeteners may impact metabolism, even at very low doses.